estuarine crocodile. Oh, hi, everybody. My name is Leo. I am a junior ranger. And this is my puppy, Hero. I just saw a big bird drop something. Do you want to help me look for it? <coughs> you found it, Hero? Oh, it's an egg. But it's already empty. I wonder what was in it. <coughs> What's the matter, Hero? Don't be sad about an empty egg. Ah, Hero! It's some kind of lizard. Are you okay, Hero? I wonder what kind of lizard this is. You know what we should do? Let's take a photo and send it to my sister, Katie. She is also a junior ranger. Say cheese. Katie, are you there? A lizard just hatched from its egg in the garden. Hi, Leo. Look at its teeth. They're tiny, but they look really sharp. Yeah, Hero already knows that. Can you find more information about it? Of course I can. Great, I'm coming up. Hero, you stay here and watch over our little friend. I'll be right back. Come on, everybody. Let's go into the treehouse. Katie, did you find out what kind of lizard it is? Hi, Leo. As it turns out, it's not a lizard. It's a crocodile. And this one is an estuarine crocodile, also known as the saltwater crocodile. A crocodile in our garden? Wow! As a baby, it's very small, but it can grow up to five meters in length. That's huge! An estuarine crocodile must eat a lot to get to that size. The estuarine crocodile is a carnivore, which means it feeds on other animals. On almost every animal, it can even attack humans. Hmm, where do estuarine crocodiles come from? Estuarine crocodiles can be found in the tropical parts of Southeast Asia, South Asia, Australia, and the Pacific. They usually live in mangrove swamps or estuaries. A mangrove swamp is a place in the tropics where trees grow thickly along a saltwater river or sea. An estuary is an area where a river meets the sea. We should go there and return the baby crocodile to its nest. Come and join us. Good thinking, Leo. See you downstairs. Welcome to the Mangrove Swamp, Junior Rangers. Ah, I see you have a baby estuarine crocodile with you. Yes, Ranger Rocky. It came from an egg that a big bird dropped in our garden. Perhaps the bird stole the egg from a nest. Estuarine crocodiles typically lay 40 to 60 eggs. If the eggs are kept at a temperature between 30 and 33 degrees Celsius, most of the baby crocodiles will be male. If the temperature is a bit higher or lower, then most baby crocodiles will be female. Unfortunately, only a few baby crocodiles will grow to become an adult. Most baby crocodiles are eaten in their first year by animals, such as large fish and birds. But as adults, these crocodiles have no natural predators, aside from humans and other estuarine crocodiles. If you want to find a baby crocodile's nest, Look for a place without large fish or birds. Large fish and birds eat baby crocodiles. And remember, always keep your distance from crocodiles. They are dangerous animals. Stay safe and good luck, Junior Rangers. Thank you, Ranger Rocky. 
Let's see what we can find. Here is a part of the mangrove swamp. Whoa! These birds are really large. And on this side is another part of the mangrove swamp. I don't see any animals around. Do you know where we should go? Over there is a part of the mangrove swamp with large birds. And over there is a part of the mangrove swamp without any animals in sight. So where should we go? There? That's right! We need to go there because there are no large birds that can eat baby crocodiles. Let's go! What is it, Hero? A sign? Oh, it's warning us that there are crocodiles nearby. I don't see any crocodiles, but we'd better be careful, Katie. Let's keep walking. It says here that crocodiles are very good at hiding in water. We should also avoid thick vegetation where crocodiles could hide. So, if crocodiles are very good at hiding, does that mean there might be crocodiles here, but we just can't see them? Um, there might be, Leo. Wait, where's Hero? can run faster than crocodiles on land. Let's hope so, Katie. Run! Oh no, another crocodile. Let's jump on these logs in the river. These aren't logs, Katie. They're crocodiles. Yikes! There's only one way out. Everybody, it's time to fly. Oh, that was close. But what should we look for now? Hello, Junior Rangers! Ranger, Ranger Rocky. Rocky! Estuarine crocodiles lay their eggs in a mound of vegetation and mud. So if you want to find the baby crocodile's nest, just look for a mound made of twigs. Not for a basket of tasty figs, or a pen full of pigs. But look for a mound made of twigs. I see. So not for a basket of tasty figs, or a pen full of pigs, but, but look, look for a mound made of twigs. Remember, mother crocodiles guard their nests fiercely, so always keep a safe distance from the nest. Thank you, Ranger Rocky. Okay, Hero, to find the baby crocodile's nest, you have to look for a mound made of twigs. Good luck. Hero, there are a few dots on your radar. One of them might be the baby crocodile's nest. What's that? Hmm, it's a bird's nest. Let's move on. Is this a crocodile's nest? It's a nest, but not of a crocodile. So let's keep looking. Is that a mound made of twigs? Yes, it is. It's the crocodile's nest. Great work, Hero. We're coming over. We did it! We found the baby crocodile's nest. Great job, everyone! Hooray! Yay! a baby estuarine crocodile in our garden. We learned that estuarine crocodiles live in a mangrove swamp or estuary. So we returned the baby crocodile to its nest in the mangrove swamp. Good job, children. You did it. You are amazing wildlife rangers. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.